Hi, Rob here from Marine Industrial. We're here today to talk about general purpose sealing with Sikaplex 291. So Sikaplex 291, it is our biggest selling uh, SKU by far. Uh, we get through a large amount of it. It's available in a few different sizes, cartridges, 300cc, uh, little really happy, uh, handy retail package, 70cc. Uh, and 400 mini bulks. Um, again, our popular one is the cartridge by far. Um, these are great for retail sales, um, small volumes. What's really cool is they've changed the packaging on these now, so you can actually reseal uh, the ends. So they're not just a one use, chuck it in the bin. So the 400 cc's, this is really useful for any trade boat builders who want to cut down wastage. Uh, obviously, when you use a cartridge, you've got the volume of the cartridge going in the bin or in the skip. Uh, when you use these mini bulks, uh, these compress, uh, you know, down to probably maybe less than a centimeter in size. So wastage is a real minimum. Uh, also, the, the price of the, of the sachet is minimal compared to the cartridge. So if you're looking to save a little bit of money, especially on wastage, uh, these are definitely the ones to go for. In terms of strength of 291, uh, so we say, roughly speaking, uh, if you are bonding two pieces of fiberglass together with good surface prep, you pretty much delaminate the gel coat from the fiberglass, it's that strong. Uh, we talk about 1.8 megapascals. So in English, that works out to around about 18 tons per meter squared until you get debonding or the adhesion failure or cohesion failure. Um, so it's really, really strong. So any general purpose bonding and sealing for marine applications uh, is perfect. So there's a lot of other competitive products out there. Uh, we see a lot of products coming in from the construction industry, you know, fantastic product, uh, big bold claims behind some of their statements of bonding underwater. To be honest with you, all of these products are moisture curing. So you add moisture, it's gonna go off, whether it's above or below waterline. To be honest with you, if you can stick stuff together underwater, uh, slightly questionable about your uh, bonding techniques there. You know, we always recommend really, really good surface prep. So SICA 291, if you're comparing it to construction products, this product is wheel marked. That basically is your guarantee from SICA that you're buying a product which has been tested for maritime construction. So now we're gonna demonstrate some of these products being used. Um, so come take a look. First off, we're going to use the cartridge of the Sikaplex 291. So when gunning it out, make sure that you keep the cartridge with a consistent pressure on the lever, gunning in a backwards motion towards yourself. When you've finished, pop the release button on the back of the skeleton gun to keep the pressure off. So I can now demonstrate actually the product has got a, a, a nice amount of viscosity. So when you're uh, bonding items overhead or on walls, um, the adhesive isn't going to run off. So to do that, I can just show you exactly how viscous the material is. It won't want to fall over of its own weight. So moving on to the 70cc pack. To use these, simply pull off the dispenser metal, unscrew the lid. Now first off, you've got to unscrew the nozzle peel away the tear off and to pierce the cartridge simply just screw the nozzle straight back in tightly give it a good twist it's now going to open the actual sachet itself and then to use the product simply screw the nozzle back on insert the metal pullback and we're off Again, when we're finished, it's not a one-shot product. Just pop the nozzle back on there, and that'll be great to use. Now, this will stay fresh for, I don't know, around about sort of 30 days before it really starts to cure in the nozzle, after which time you might need a screwdriver just to pull it out. Another mistake that a lot of people do is they actually apply like a screw or a nail. They push it down into the cartridge itself. Don't do that. That's the worst thing you can do. Actually, you're increasing the cure time. Uh, you're, sorry, you're speeding up the, the, the cure of the product. It's a moisture curing product. There's going to be moisture on that screw. You push that into the cartridge, it's going to start going off in the cartridge. The best method for a cartridge to seal it up, just get some good electrician's tape, some PVC tape, 
wrap it around the, uh, the end of the nozzle as, as well as you can and seal it down that way. The last of the packaging uh, we mentioned earlier, the four packaging. To use that, simply just get a, a pair of side cutters, snip the end off. That will fit easily into a uh, mini bulk dispensing gun. Now we sell these in either air format or manual. This is a manual one, pretty straight, straightforward. Um, in there's a plunger, pull back, open it up, pop your mini bulk uh, sachet in there. Uh, you'd have a nozzle in here as well. Screw that on and you're ready to go. So that pretty much sums up everything for the Sikaflex 291. If you're in the trade and you want to know more about the products that we sell, give us a call on 01692 406 822 or look us up on marineindustrial.co.uk.